Hey guys, I'm HP and this is Dr. Pink and today's topic is Sex Machine by the Godfather of Soul, the hardest working man in showbiz, James Brown. <laughs> yeah, Sex Machine, for those who don't know it, it's this one here. Rich. Get up. <laughs> yeah, that's the song. Then we check out the rhythm guitar. Well, it's uh, basically, of course, James Brown makes a thing, but the uh, rhythm guitar is really iconic for this song, and we really check out what the rhythm guitar is doing. I've chosen the live version Teatro in 1971, I think, in Italy, as a longer version, but probably all versions are more or less the same. The rhythm guitar can be played in l slightly different variations, but uh, I'm going to show you how you get into this kind of playing and how you get the main figure and also make the variations, especially on the first part. So the first thing is that the song is in 109 BPM. So you need to have a certain speed to play this. That means if you play this kind of rhythm guitar, you need to, you need to have those 60 notes running, you know. This is the beat. Oops. See? Chaka, 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 chaka. That's the main speed, and you need to be able to hold that speed for, in this case, uh, seven or eight minutes. So you really need to stay relaxed. I normally do this when I have a longer thing real funky rhythm guitar i play with that pick but somehow for me it's easier to stay relaxed in your in your arm here if you get a s if you're a little bit under tension here you will not make the seven minutes believe me that guys because you really need to get it going like chuck it and you have to be s relaxed and you still need to be able to dance then not like you know chuck it chuck it so the first exercise one two three four one two three four so this is the beat one two three four one two three four one two three four once you have this one here then the main rhythm comes i'm going to show you the chord is this one here it's e flat nine fifth fret here on the d string bari on the six and the pinky goes in the eight here we're playing on the high four strings and you have one two three four so one two three four one so or without the counting the sixes one two three and four one two so one two three and four that's the main rhythm one so that's the main figure now you need to fill up the in-betweens that means you have these dead notes so there you make 60 notes So let's do this. So that's this one. Sometimes the guy plays also um, one on the one, so that will be one. So one. Would be this one here, an eight note to, to the, the sixteen as dead notes. That also happens, I think. So, 
or a version where you place two 60 notes at the beginning. So you just keep the thing going on with the 60 notes, but the first two you play. I would say that one is played sometimes beside the one with only dead notes. Yeah. That will be the first part. And as I said, the main thing is to stay relaxed in your arm, that this thing just go keeps on going, you know. When you play this, it just you really need to stay relaxed in your arm. Yeah. Now let's go to the bridge. They call it, then they start to say, hey, go to the bridge, yeah, go to the bridge, yeah. Go to the bridge and on cue, that means on a sign, they switch to the bridge. It's not really, um, probably they count it through, but I'm pretty sure they just made it on cue. They say, oh, let's go to the bridge means the band now goes to the bridge. And the bridge is this here. <laughs> Same thing again. We have these 60 notes and then we have first two 60 notes. So, same chord as before, but now in the 10th fret and with the pinky here in the 3rd, 15, 13, so. And then this is a little bit difficult, then 3 comes with upstrokes, so. And you just play the top two notes in this case. And then you just keep it going on the... See? That's a little bit the hard part, I must say. I needed five minutes myself to really figure out. Let's try with the track. Oh yeah, that was the ending. Um, that one is also on cue. Let's play it several times on cue. And then comes... I'm not quite sure what the chord is which is played. There are things not a chord. It's just the horn section and the guitar plays kind of a, a D. So 7-7, seven, seven, you would just play 8 notes. 1 and 2 and 3 and 4. And the bass could play a D or a B flat. I think it's a D there because I, I really listened to it carefully. Um, and then it goes back to the first section. The bridge part is really, you really need to keep it going on and stay relaxed in your arm. And then you just play these two or you can play them. That will be most the one which I heard out here. Fifth fret, fourth fret, seven, seven with the pinky. And then we go to the beginning. And that's also the ending of the song is, but then it goes finished. Yeah, that's the whole thing. I'm gonna play the whole thing for you now. From the chords, it's not a brainer, but the, there are, uh, there are uh, Picking hand is already a bit of the problem because think about it, you need to keep it going for seven minutes. And this thing here is have to stay relaxed, dance and make a smile. <laughs> so <laughs> let's go to the bridge. Uh, 
and so on. Yeah, that was <laughs> Sex Machine by James Brown, the ring guitar. I hope I don't uh, get a copyright strike on this one. But if it's not such a problem, I just want to show you this one, then James Brown himself gets royalties for this video. <laughs> That's okay for me. <laughs> yeah, guys. <coughs> I hope you enjoy this tutorial. The backing track which I created can be downloaded in the HP Crazy Guitar Academy as, as also the tabs. If you want those, uh, follow the link in the description box below and make a premium membership upgrade to help me to keep my Guitar Academy growing. Also, please join there if you love what I'm doing to the free basic membership you can talk with others uh, and you still can watch the videos and there's a place to talk about the lessons uh, which i'm providing here on the channel because there is more possibilities for me to support you in your learning process so please join the hp crazy guitar academy either free membership but uh, please make the prima membership upgrade in these times to support my work yeah one more to say me and Dr. Pinkor. Sing bye.